Well, this is fun, isn't it? How often do you come across an Egyptian steel? Because that's what this is. Any vertical monument of this type is referred to as a steel. Usually they're in stone and can be kept outside in a graveyard or whatever it might be. They've got a text on them always, but this one is Egyptian and it dates from between the birth of Christ to 600 years BC in that patch of Egyptian history. And because it's got all these hieroglyphs and whatnot, you can decipher all of that and it tells you a story. It tells you the story of how the late departed might be assisted in the afterlife. That's in this raft of script underneath. And it gives worship to the god Ra, who's represented by this winged falcon at the top. I mean, it's, it's a marvellous survival potentially two and a half thousand years old. And what I particularly like about it, if you have a look around the back, it's got a handwritten paper label, which talks about a sale at Sotheby's. <laughs> Isn't that marvellous? So that piece of paper proves that it was in an auction a hundred years ago and was well regarded, came from a famous collection in 1922. So this is all the provenance that one can weave about this delightful object. What's it worth? Well, the upcoming timeline auction estimate is 10 to 14,000 pounds. And at that, it's a steal.